I'm Ryan from So Is It Any Good. We're at the Sydney Oz Comic Con 2015. Let's go check it out. All right, we're talking to Lizzie, and she has done an amazing cosplay, I believe, of a dark elf on, on Blood Elf. Sorry, my mistake on uh, World of Warcraft. This is incredible. How long did this take you to make? It started in April and it took for, yeah, a thousand hours. And so is this, it's clearly not your first time. So what, what's, this is your first time? Yeah, the only other thing I've done is Officer Jenny back in 2011. First time, my first one was, uh, was a Ghostbuster, but uh, my pack was mainly made from cardboard and stuff. So it's pretty epic. There's a, a story from when you were younger, maybe uh, pretending to be in Lord of the Rings. Yeah, well, I grew up on a sheep farm, and I'd, I'd read Lord of the Rings when I was seven, although I didn't really understand all of My hero was Aragorn. So I used to ride around on my horse with a big stick, chasing the sheep like they were orcs. My dad would say, they're, they're sheep, mate, we're trying to sell these for, for meat. You can't go around butchering them with your sword. But um, I just, I wanted to be Aragorn, so when I finally got to kick his butt in Lord of the Rings, it was like, well, I might not have been him, but at least I got the, you know, crash talking, it was good. Yeah. Some people pretend to, you know, play with action figures. You're on a horse battling the sheep. So you've worked on uh, heaps of Peter Jackson movies, Lord of the Rings, all the way back to um, Brain Dead, which is awesome. So what was your best experience? Yeah, and when you get your first action figure, you kind of go, okay, yeah. Did you have to get a model for that or anything? I didn't, but I didn't really think about it, them selling them afterwards. I was walking past a place in Santa Monica called the Monkey Puzzle Shop, and this dude who ran the store ran out and went, sign this for me, man, and I'll give you one. And I was going, dude, what are you talking about? He says, this is you, this is you and Shaku on the wag. And I'm going, no, really? And he went, yeah, yeah. And he said, and there's one of you as a black rider, and there's one of you as Shnaga. And I went, really? Oh, like, oh my god, so yeah, I was like, I was fan, I was fanning my own yeah. action figure, it was really weird. I can imagine just being out the front of Toys R Us at like midnight going, I must get every one of me, I must get everything. How'd you guys come up with the costumes? Well, um, it's just a mixture of things, you know, you order uh, stuff you have to have made, other stuff you order from overseas. You've got to source it from all different locations. Do you reckon Porkins could have been a Jedi at one point? It wouldn't surprise me, he could do just about anything, that guy. Yeah. Indiana Jones and everything, this guy, this guy appears everywhere, he's like the unforgotten hero of the 80s. Even when the man dies, he does it properly, you know. <laughs> he makes it a big deal, you know. I mean, the other guys, they're just sort of like little tough in the background, yeah. but nah, his was spectacular, man. <laughs> he made you know he was in trouble. Yeah. What are you dressed as today? I am Marty McFly from Back to the Future Part 2. That's awesome. And what day did Marty McFly come back to the future? 21st well, of October 2015 at 4.29. Uh, what are you doing for Future Day? Future Question. day. Okay, future so I'm waking up uh, fairly early because I want to be awake for when I travel into the future at 4:29 a.m. So it's gonna be a really early start. I don't know why. I just, no, I feel that's like unreal. It's, I feel like that's it's unreal. Important. I appreciate it. I that. feel like it's important. Okay, and do, did you happen to get to work on the any of the new films that are coming out? Uh, uh, as of five days ago, I've been given permission by Lucasfilm to say that the Once and Future Akbar is returning in episode seven. Have you seen much of the film? Have you seen the whole thing? You're going off eyes right now. It's a trap! 